So I started Uber driving a bit and trying different shifts and seeing, uh, you know, what the different rates are, what's the best time to go. Um, so I had a run um, that I picked up some people to go to dinner and I ended up dropping off their son at uh, some event. And so the run was 53 minutes and it was um, about 27 miles and um, the fare was $35. I got $35 in the fare. Um, so I thought that was great. That was like one of my first days. Uh, it was about five o'clock. It wasn't, uh, I don't know if it was a surge or not. I haven't really quite figured those surges out yet. Um, so I'm calculating, wow, this is about $35 an hour. That's not bad. Minus gas. Okay. Um, later that night during the bar shift, as I call it, um, I picked up a group of people and drove them home and one of them forgot their credit card at the bar. So as soon as we got there, we had to turn all the way around. Go back to the bar, pick up the credit card, turn around, go all the way home. And I'm thinking, wow, this is going to be a great fare. It ended up to be 73 minutes uh, and about 29 miles. And my fare that I got was $25. I would think, you know, 10 o'clock on a Friday night would be peak surge hours. That being said, you're still back to 20 ish dollars an hour, you know, because uh, it was 73 minutes. Either way, worked out pretty good. Um, but when you tally up the days on some days, um, you know, you're looking at like $12 an hour. I can work seven hours and, you know, I'll have like $63 in fares, not including tips. Tips are great. They're not necessary. Not everybody tips. But um, I noticed the dinner crowd tips. They tip uh, when they're going to dinner. You know, it'll be a $3 fare down to the restaurant, $10 tip all the time. Uh, I am going to attempt to drive Uber in a Lincoln Town Car. Uh, I like Lincolns. You can pick one up cheap, used, you know, find an old lady who wants to sell you a, a Lincoln. They're great cars. They hold a lot of people. You can hold three people in front, including the driver, and four in the back. And they got giant trunks, which you don't need as an Uber driver, but you know, it's nice to have uh, it's nice to have a trunk space so you put all your stuff in there. Um, and you get, with the, with the Lincoln Town Car, you get the XL Uber, and you get the Select Uber, which instead of a $20 fare, you're going to get $38 fare. 